what, what them haters talking about. Yeah. What's up, family? Donald Trump, your president, hit back at the media for its coverage of his inadequate response to the coronavirus pandemic. As you know, Donald Trump, he's one of those characters who wouldn't know responsibility if it hit him in the face. This is a dude who blames everybody but himself, and he takes all the credit when things go good. He takes it all by himself. But what about Obama? What about Hillary? Well, you know that was a problem before I ever came in. You know, I'm such a whiny little heifer. Dude went on Twitter, because you know that's his favorite place to be. And he took some shots at the media. Here's what he had to say. I watched and listened to fake news, CNN, MSDNC, ABC, NBC, CBS, some of Fox, desperately and foolishly pleading to be politically correct, the New York Times and the Washington Post, and all I see is hatred of me at any cost. Don't they understand that they are destroying themselves? No, they don't. They understand that they are covering you, doofus, destroying yourself and the nation. My God, how in the hell does somebody like that become president in the year 2020, our Lord? God, what the hell happened? America's supposed to be a smart nation, a progressive nation. We're going back socially, family. Do you understand that? Societies are supposed to move forward, not backwards. Because of unfits like Trump, American society is moving backwards at a rapid pace. I don't know if it can survive. I really don't. America, the United States in particular, is the laughing stock of the world. My God, what a whining crybaby. And this is a dude who takes shots at everybody. But the first time somebody take a shot at him, he's playing the victim. He loves playing the victim. I've never seen anybody who plays the victim and the hero at the same time as well as he do. Think about it, family. Anytime you hear him talking, he's either speaking of his heroism or his victimization. Listen, next time you talk, the very next time you listen to him talk, think about what I just said. Put it together. He's either pumping himself up or he's playing the victim how somebody did something to him and it's spilling over into American society. I see it all the time. Everybody is out for self and everybody is playing the victim. Public health and national security experts shake their heads when Donald Trump says the coronavirus came out of nowhere and blindsided the world. You know why? Because they've been warning this super dummy about the next pandemic for years and criticized his administration's decision in 2018 to dismantle a National Security Council directorate at the White House charged with preparing for when, not if, another pandemic would hit the nation. Fast forward, after he was briefed about the dangers of the coronavirus, this dude fixed his mouth to say that it wasn't a big deal. One day we'll just wake up and it'll, be, it'll just be gone. And then he started saying that it was a hoax perpetrated by the Democrats. The 
undermine his presidency, his reelection. And he kept saying, it. and once he started saying it, here come his dummy minion followers. Trump said it, I gotta say it. Trump said it, I gotta say it. They just started repeating it. Now their asses are dying. They ain't saying it no more. It's no longer a hoax. All of a sudden, it's real. It's protect yourself. Stay in the house. Self-quarantine. Get checked out. Wash your hands 200 times a day. The irony here is that this fool created this mess. And if a cure is developed before he leaves office, he'll no doubt take the credit. No more talk. What the ladies talking about? Yeah.